What up? Hello, hello, friends. Lost tubers. We're group. back. We are back. Sadly. Thanks we're for back. joining us, first of all. Yeah, thanks, thanks for, for watching this us. video. You guys are awesome. We uh, I we realize it's been forever. It's been two weeks. It's not quite forever. I think it's been three weeks. No, it's been two weeks. I feel like it's been three. We didn't do one last week because we went and helped Cassandra's dad cut down yes. some trees. And I got pretty sunburned. Everybody got sunburned, but I got the worst of it. And he I was peeling. was a like just a cherry. I was peeling like a snake. He is a snake. So Who that knows? doesn't look good. No. And then also, and then we were, we, he says it's that. It's because I hated him and I didn't want to talk to him. And it's we were part, fighting all part. week. So What about <laughs> if I hated you? How could you? That's How true. could you? <laughs> okay, so... We uh, have a lot of great yes. stuff to show you. We've got, uh, we uh, framed a model. We did. We're releasing a pattern. I've got yeah. an update. I am next video. I will finally have the mermaid done. I've got a bunch of stash acquisition stuff. I've got some needle minders to show you. And then I've got, uh, what? Lots of stuff. Lots of stuff. Releasing or released? Released. released I forgot that it takes pattern. him like five days to put this thing out. <laughs> Because he's he has to rewatch it and rewatch it and make sure he looks good. I gotta really put a lot of filters on so I can be presentable. Yes. Yeah. You're right. You're so handsome. Okay, here we go. So, so but oh, before and, before she goes crazy, and he's like, "We can't do it back there. You still have Easter up." And I'm like, Dude. "Okay." <laughs> so I was like, I moved the bunnies, and then I moved the little egg tree that I had over there, Dude, and you're then diving yourself out. You can't tell behind the scenes stuff. I still got eggs up there though. <laughs> So it's we're transitioning. You already just drove out. I did. I saw <laughs> Easter up. I plan to not clean up my Easter decorations for a while. Last year we had Easter up until almost. Yep. Uh, how Bunnies so are year round. That's the record. So we're gonna see if we can at least Bunnies tie it or beat yeah. it this year. Okay. So oh, and we have a giveaway. That's the other thing. And the funny thing is, Jillian, your threads are still sitting right there. They're coming today. Because I don't know. I. It, here's the funny thing, Jillian. We ship packages every day because, again, we sell LuLaRoe and clothing, if you're like, what's she talking about? And um, talking about that amazing uh, every you day. On. Thank you. I know, cute, right? It's yeah, like, it looks good on you. Ever. I love this hoodie. Like thank a little you. Uh, mauve type thing going on there? It's pink. It's pink. It's, it's not really it's mauve. Like it's rose. more of a pink. It's rose. Uh, rose. That's what I was looking for. Rose. Uh, anyway, so, so he's being nice because yeah. I put on makeup today. <laughs> Finally. <laughs> Every day I Just come kidding. down the stairs and he's like, she doesn't even need makeup, you guys. Every day she comes down the stairs, I'm actually like in awe. <laughs> there we go. There's our thumbnail. There's our thumbnail. Okay, so um, anyways, Jillian, your threads are right there. And this is the stupid thing. I Stupid thing. I always print out package labels every single day. We go to the post office every single day, but we don't wait in line. Well, I don't know if I can stick those threads in just a regular envelope. I'm pretty sure I can, but I don't know what postage is going to be. Because uh, I think it's a quarter of an inch thick for regular. I don't know. This is something that I don't even need to address on here. But I'm so sorry. Aaron, she when are those going to ship? Today. They're going to be today. They're Before be this in video even comes out, this Jillian, is going to be Jillian, it's because he doesn't want to wait in line. So, Jillian. There's coronavirus out there. There's you know coronavirus. I mean? He doesn't want to wait in line. Okay, so that's all that we're going. They're, so what? By the time this comes out, they're already on they're their way. They're going to be so. on their way. Jillian, we are so sorry. We are so, so sorry. So thank you, and you're welcome. Okay, so. What can I say? But we do have. Before we go into that, what? can we just appreciate them for hanging out with us for a minute? Of course we appreciate them for hanging out with us. Do we? Yeah. We do a little bit. We really do. Thanks for hanging out with us. We do a lot. For all the, the new people hanging out with us. Yeah. We are Aaron Houston oh, and yeah, Cassandra, Houston. Cassandra Houston. Autumn Lane Stitchery. Yeah. For those of you returning, you, you know we're a little best. bit maniacs. Thank you. We really do bit. appreciate it because I we really I realize that I'm a lot to deal with. Uh and there's a kind of a discrepancy between <laughs> maybe. A little bit. Extra. I have a lot to hang out with, guys. Yeah, and our kids are all the same way. We are just very loud. loud. And, so and they're also playing outside right now. It's so not if they like come we're and like jump boisterous. In, it's just it. that we just have out. we just have a very loud personality. But we're not necessarily boisterous. But I realize I can be a lot to take. So thank you for those who. Uh, <laughs> so you should appreciate me a lot more for dealing with this. You're kind of a drone. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. <laughs> I'm just kidding. 
He's not. He's he uh, he no. is still camera shy. He's a cam. He gets camera shy. So uh, after three years of selling mainly live, he still gets camera shy. It's hard. It's, it's hard not. Here for it's not. It's hard life out there for a pimp. <laughs> you heard it from the man. That's really what we do uh, when we're not selling patterns. You guys, okay. it's hot as mofo in here right it's now. It's not. I'm wearing a hoodie. It's I crazy. don't know how, if she starts sweating profusely by the end of this video, you know. It's Just like, because <laughs> I sweat profusely and I don't let my scabs heal. Like, pick my scabs. He doesn't Just let his scabs heal. That's what he says. I thought he said to pick my scabs. No, he says just because I don't let my scabs no. heal. Whatever. Maybe. Let's we'll have think. a discussion I'm sure. about it. I'm pretty sure I'm right. Tell, tell us who's right, me or Aaron. <laughs> it's me. Okay, so uh, what are we going to start with? Shall we start with know. the frame job? Okay, I've got to tell you this real quick because you're going to be like, what did she do? Okay, first of all, everything is shut down because of the coronavirus, okay? Uh, no frame place is open. And so, and normally I always go to Hobby Lobby. They always have a great assortment. Uh, only only Joann's, which has nothing uh, as far as framing. Uh-oh, here are kids. Oh, no, they're just playing. It's like our kids are outside uh, playing water. They're doing a water stuff. fight, so they're going to come in being yeah. loud. Uh, okay, so um, anyways, so I go to Michael's, and there was a frame in at first. I was like, oh, my gosh, it's very a very gaudy frame. Okay, very gaudy. And just like very, it almost looked like just this vulgar gold. And, um, and so I, I'm like, okay, I was like, oh, we'll see what happens. We'll see what else I find. And I just didn't find anything I like. It's for the geisha. And I was like, I kind of want it almost like an ornamental, you know, type of look for the geisha uh, that Kenny stitched. Kenny, you're the man. Listen, first, Kenny. first, shout out. To Kenny, to Kenny Lair. Can we give him a round of applause for his I mean, we should, we should really show it. Like yeah. Okay, so here we go. This is the gay shop. Okay, so I realize oh, that so this looks very bright gold. It is not this bright in real life. It actually looks fantastic. And if you see, it's like almost an aged gold look, okay? And you Word. had to do it because look at all the gold um, petite treasure braid. So we had to go with the gold. So here she is. Did Kenny not do an amazing did, job? Did. Uh, did I do a great job framing it? Thank yes, you. Yes, you did. Uh, I, feel like I was going to say something, Ru, but no, you did amazing. I feel like I stretched it pretty you well. I'm getting it. better. You guys, I thought the stretch job is really good, actually. Really? Yes. Very good. You're only, I'm not even just saying. You're that only being really. nice to me because I'm wearing makeup, and you probably what? I'm trying it. to. You're don't trying to it. eyeball my piece. I'm <laughs> trying to eyeball my piece. Don't piece do it. it. Um. <laughs> so you got look it. how red this he is. Came out amazing. Get out. He get still out here. blushes. Can I just say? Oh, look at you. What is oh, happening? No. Technical difficulties. No. Aaron is um. He was listening to a an M and M thing. Anyway, not not the candy. Anyways, <laughs> a documentary again, on the candy. Aaron <laughs> blushes, but this man is from Las Vegas. So what does that have to do with anything? That you're blushing and you've probably. <laughs> <laughs> I'll just end it there. He's from Las Vegas. You guys, this man should let's not talk be about Let's this talk about this geisha. <laughs> geisha. <laughs> okay, so let's show her up close a little bit better. Babe, do you want to move your iPad just in case? Yippers. No, you're fine. So you can see that she has these, uh, you know, the little uh, red flowers. Oh, and she so has looks. these, she has these, what are they called? Rondelles? I don't so she is out now. now by the She's way. out right. now. Uh, you have the little teardrop. So she has some little beads coming down. So look, would you look, you guys, at look her. how amazing it is. And I'm sorry. I love this. Here, I love, I love the pattern. Or I love the frame. So at first I was like, that frame is really a she lot. She's thinking about doing a black one. I wanted like a black ornamental one. Like you want to you do something I mean? a little more modern. You could do either a flat black one or you could do a little more ornamental. I didn't ornamental. want modern. I wanted I'm ornamental. Because she's like... Sorry, I was, getting, I was getting the hair off. He's like, <laughs> I blew in your face. <laughs> he's like, go behind you. I was blowing the hair Gosh. off. But it... <laughs> they, I'm she's sorry. amazing, though. She's amazing. So you Kenny guys, did a great she job. Looks so good. Uh, she's actually done what? Okay, so whatever. So here she is on uh, on camera. So it, 
I guess yeah. it does look a little bit more muted. On the actual pattern, it looks very bright. Yeah. But you can see the frame we chose, it is more aged. So it's not like terribly like neon, yeah. like we're driving through Vegas and looking at whatever. Anyways, but I will say when I framed her, guys, Looks her so center good. is right here. And we framed her off center because, why did we frame her off center? Well, because she would be way over here. She would have been she way She would be right. way off center. And if yeah. we, I wanted to center her yeah. from this side, you know, the width of the whole thing actually centered even though she's a little bit off center obviously. so what i did was yeah normally when i frame i take the diagonal on the back of the the foam core board and then i take a pin you know and i mark it so i get the very center of the foam core board and then i take the middle of the actual pattern itself and then i just stick a needle in it and then stick it where the middle is and then i start stretching it I don't even know if this is right. I'm not a framer. I'm not a professional framer. Oh, looks uh, good. But this looks pretty profesh, right? It's pretty good. Uh, but anyway, so uh, Aaron's like, no, you, we need to move her. So the center is actually here on the pattern, but the center is probably what? More like here? No, I just moved it over. So it's just like right here. Okay. I just took it and moved it left a little bit. So it was more center from. Okay. So anyways, that is the geisha. But. <laughs> yes. I have to say this. Look what? how. When I so when I did it, I wanted the focus to be here. Obviously, it's the brightest part of the pattern, but yes. look how dark, much darker the bottom is. And then I brightened it as it went up to kind of create the focus and kind of fade this out. But it's still it's brilliant. But you can still like there's still a lot of detail, but it just puts the focus on the face more. Very uh, brilliant. It's so good. And then there's the nice. Wow, uh, you're very modest. What what I say? Wow, it's so good. It is. Well, the <laughs> final thing came out so good. It did. Kenny did amazing. I. Basically, just it's amazing. think this is Kenny's work. So, okay, Kenny's so work. Kenny, Kenny, oh, uh, as far as, should we stick her here? You guys, is she going to fall on top of us? Thing. Should I be modest? Not really. No. <laughs> okay, but I see your praise. I feel fall? like that's going to be a bad move. Here, we can move this and just put it, lean it up against And then she'll fall. Uh, I feel like. Okay. Oh, that would be a tragedy. Okay, so she's gonna fall. Well, she'll be all right. There we go. Okay, don't hit her. Okay, okay back there. She's gonna hit. Okay, so Kenny had a great idea, and uh, because because I'm a douche, I vetoed it. Only because Kenny, listen, uh, we I no one could pronounce it, and so Kenny had a great idea. What was it called? Red flower, but he had it in Japanese. It was Akai Hana, is how you Akai say Hana. It. Yeah. A-K-A-I-H-A-N-A. -A -A. A-K-A. It means you the red flower. Yeah, it means the red flower. And so I was what? like, here's the only, but no, I didn't really veto it. Okay, so I only vetoed it. I loved where he was going with that. And we still took his idea and did a little spin off of it. So, because I love that. I did love his idea. I just, Akai Hana, it, uh. I already kept saying it wrong. Nobody saying it wrong, wrong but then see. also it was very. It wasn't like an elegance, like it, Akai Hana, I don't know. I wanted it to flow. And uh, because I loved it, Kenny. <laughs> there was multiple reasons why. Okay, but anyways, it didn't flow off the tongue, so I was like, okay. I love what Kenny's though saying because Kenny did the model stitch, and obviously we both love Kenny dearly. Mm -hmm. um, and uh, yeah, so I was like, oh, what about if we still took Japanese but did a little bit different name that flows a little bit so we are looking up japanese just like sayings i don't know japanese uh like sayings and names. i was just like even look, looking yeah, at names, names. uh so we were just because we loved the idea that kenny did so we a a actually ended up going with ready da, 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 da. so we kind of did uh, like her name which is sakura sakura sakura, sakura. <laughs> but if you're american you just call it sakura yeah, yeah if you're a total <laughs> american like us <laughs> if sakura. you don't want to try to sound no. fancy sakura <laughs> Sakura. So that's that's like her name of the actual like yeah. instead of just like the red flower kind of a general name we like named her and that's the name of the flower which means cherry blossoms yeah, still it means cherry blossom. so you know it kind of matches matches with the pattern but yeah. it's like an actual Japanese name as well so yeah so here she is Sakura. Look at how good how, the, the uh, yeah. like the picture is. Yeah, so here's oh, the picture. I that, and you right? guys know I always have to go and like decorate around it. So I got a bunch of cherry blossoms. And see what I mean? Like how vibrant that yellow is in here, but she's not necessarily. 
Uh, but yeah, but we did the cherry blossoms around her and um, the pattern. Now, my favorite part, the little things that he puts in here. So as you know, the man does these backgrounds. As you can see, it's like this Jap uh, Japanese type of bridge that no, goes to the front and uh, all the way across, right? Mm -hmm. uh, this is my favorite part. He had to point it out to me because I never would have noticed. Can you get one of our regular patterns? So you know our logo. Hi, Hannies. Autumn Lane Stitchery, right? So here's our normal logo. Well, is that the normal one? That's the normal one. Fall okay. leaves. Yeah. Notice that's a cabin, right? Can you tell? That's a little, like a little cabin, cabin on at the end lane. of the lane. Look at this. He changed, first of all, he made the end of the things cherry blossoms. Can you, If you can tell, that's a little Japanese. It's a little uh, Japanese house. A little Village Japanese house, house type thing. That like a traditional is Japanese probably house. the best thing I've ever done. Isn't that cool? <laughs> you guys. I love that. I, when I thought of it, I was like, yes. It, this is so awesome. It's so really cool. that's probably my favorite thing that I've ever done. It's the only reason why I've been divorced him is because of cool stuff like that. <laughs> okay, I'm just kidding. I'm just, we joke, you guys, we, we joke. joke. So this she is, jokes. this is available right now in oh, our it? Etsy store. It is. Um, we have not yet started to uh, supply it to the shops. Um, we will, of course, because we want to support our shops. In the next few days. In the next few days. Yeah. Um, we are going to open it up for the other shops because we have to like add it to our order form and then we have to send it out to the shops. But if you don't want to wait for us to ship it to your shops and then get it from your shops, we have it. And no. uh, you can just go to our Etsy store and we, like I said, we will ship same or next day to you guys, directly to you guys. So uh, in our Etsy store, by the way, Aaron will probably link it. I'll link it down below. But it's just... Um, Autumn Lane Stitchery on Etsy. Yeah, it's just Etsy, Etsy.com forward slash shop forward slash Autumn Lane Stitchery or just search Autumn Lane Stitchery. It'll be there. Uh, which, by the way, our She's name out. is you Autumn guys Lane Stitchery. You guys me for like... Forever. Since, that, since I did the original yeah. like poll yep. in our group yeah it was a year ago so and then guys she uh she yeah we do have she's mostly dmc we did add some bling this time so she has a couple uh beads and then a couple tr boxes of treasures uh and then the rainbow gallery petite treasure braid which uh. is that gold in there but yeah she has a little bit of beads and of course if you're on a budget friends just on sub, a budget. sub whatever you want if you can't afford the petite treasure braid the petite treasure braids act braid is actually pretty cheap it's like two bucks i believe and i always get my threads from just one two three Ooh, stitch if you want like it the shiny local. the shiny ness is like awesome. you can't really tell on the camera yeah but it adds it just like a nice, awesome. like elegant touch. Yeah. But you could always, you can just do like a very light yellow as well. Yeah, it'll get the same kind of effect that I was going for. And and honestly, and I'll say this and before though, change. I'll say this before is um, I know some people do run on a budget. I will say that before I did hand dyed fabric again, and I've said this before in another video. Before I spent the extra ten or fifteen dollars on a hand dyed piece of fabric, I would just buy regular plain fabric. And I regret, I regret after knowing about hand dyed fabric and not spending the extra money, I regret, like I, I said it before in another video, I did um, one of Amir Bilia on a plain fabric after I'd found out about hand dyed fabric, I regret it because I, if I ever end up redoing, I will end up redoing her if I ever have the time. Um, because the hand dyed fabric just adds so much. So to me, something that I'm going to work on for six, you know, six to 10 weeks or even longer, 15 bucks is like minuscule extra, you know? Yeah. So same thing with the, the thread. I mean, you can sub it for a DMC, which is like 50 cents, but splur, I would say, honestly, it's, two, you know, it's two bucks extra, you know, for the thread. So if you can, obviously I know people run on a budget and not everybody can get the threads, uh, depending on their location. So, um, but if, if you can go the extra mile and buy the threads and like the extra stuff, I think that it really adds. So, so before, before we move on, I just want to, there's probably people who didn't, cause we showed it before, but there's mm -hmm. probably people who didn't, uh, like a client or a great Dane. That is Clyde. Look how big the head is. Big boy. It's a big boy. Oh, aren't man, you, buddy? All the dogs are here now. <laughs> oh, big boy. Yes. So we showed this before. Good boy. Um, 
But, you know, for anybody who hasn't seen it, I have to talk about the background again. Yeah. Because I just, like... Oh, yeah. So, the background is a sun. I, I intended her to be kind of standing in front of the setting sun. But, as you can see, it, it kind of doubles as uh, her umbrella, umbrella or the parasol, whatever you want to call yeah. it. So, you can kind of see the spokes there. But then it also, like... I did a tree in the background, so it kind of looks like a tree in front of the sun to just kind of give it a little bit more Gosh, like of an actual background to it. So yeah, I just, see the spokes. I kind of like when people tree. discover it themselves, but I just, it's a, I think it's, it's cool. really cool. It's idea. a very cool pattern. Yeah. It's a so, very cool pattern. So that's the so, geisha. So that so is cool. our geisha. I like it. And she is amazing. And we hope you guys dig her. Yes. Right? Okay. So, what now, Cassandra? Okay, yeah. so uh, next we will do, let me do a little update of The Mermaid. Uh, so yeah, next time I hope to actually have her framed. I am not sure with um, how things are going, if I will find a frame that I love for her, but She's I, done, didn't, all. I didn't take her off because I didn't want to take her off. Guys, this is all I have. In fact, in facto, in so facto, that's all. That's it. <laughs> right there. Is it super frustrating? It's when so you can, stupid. When you can see the finish line that close. I literally could finish this today if I didn't have a bunch of stuff to do. It is uh, so crazy. frustrating. So it looks yeah, really good though. It's really coming along. Just have you can see I finished the anchor. I what are these things called? Like these little. Like, is it tube just, thingies? Who, I have no idea to be honest. I'm not They're even gonna pretend really like cool that. with the little bubbles coming out. The little tube things, They're whatever. So tube, tubules <laughs> or something. Tubular. Dude, we could be like uh, PS. Do you guys know? Do you, I don't even think this show's on. Mike Rowe. Yeah, Mike Rowe, Dirty he's, Jobs. He's significantly older than me. I love him. Wow. <laughs> I was, I was thinking because he did the he Rowe. did the what are they called like the 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 weird gooey worms or something what there was a dirty jobs he did I don't know. I don't where he it. got oh, where he got really Mike dirty Rowe. i love micro <laughs> uh do all you ladies love micro as well i love micro well i like masculine men you got hair in your mouth there i don't like oh look how cute he is he just got the hair out of my mouth we have like three dogs. I'm used to constant hair in my mouth. Like I open my mouth and it's like <laughs> suction. Um, yeah, he's just very, I don't know why I thought of my grow, but cause the little, they're like bo boober tubers or something. Boober tubers? What are they? <laughs> Gooey worms or something? What? The underwater yeah. tubes. I've got to yeah, see what it is. They're not mm. that, but they look really great. It's like a have... gooey worm or something. Gooey I'll show worm. this while you decide to Google everything while it's, we're on the video. What the crap is it? Look at it? the cool anchor there, y'all. It's There's not a, little a gooey bit worm. Of, you can see a little bit of that trigger. The, this is a My, sparkly uh, thread. What is it? Cranic? Cr what do we use? Uh, no, we use petite, tre uh, petite treasure braid. Petite yeah. treasure braid. So it's sparkly and shiny, braid. but the, on the camera, it's not really showing up uh, like it should. But also she it has it around so her little tail there. Cool. Look at how good that's turning out. It is so cool. Look at the little coral reef shelf. Dude, here. He lo I love... It's okay. so cool. Uh, yeah, it's coming you out. You can nice. show me here's that. Here's the thing. When you I saw what? this... Here's a picture. Here's some Mike Rowe for you. <laughs> <laughs> well, okay, back to... Sorry. No, I was I, trying to figure out what they were like, calling. Obviously, these right. are my designs. But when I'm like, oh, it's really cool, it's different for me because I draw it. And then oh, yes. when you stitch it or Kenny stitches the geisha... It's like it's yours. Then it's not like I'm but looking it's not at my mine, piece. It's yours, but it's not because you're like you're doing it. So I'm looking at your work and I'm like, man, that's awesome. And I'm but complimenting my myself work. in the process, which you know, <laughs> they're so dumb. I'm just kidding. So, but yeah. it's kind of weird for me because it's so sorry. This is just the bottom corner. It's just but I'm not taking it off because I'm so freaking close. Like if I could have yeah, awesome. worked on it this morning, I did work on it this morning. If I could have worked on it this afternoon, but the rest is oh done. Oh my gosh, it would so be it would so be ready. So I'm Next going time. to I'll finish it Maybe. probably tomorrow. Uh, yeah, I'll probably finish it tomorrow. Cause last time, that's your uh, Last time I hadn't, I had just gotten to here. Uh, oh, see here they are again. The little, the little underwater thingies with the bubbles coming out. But look, a little gold crown. It's so cool. So yeah, cool. next time I treasure. I show this, hopefully I will have it framed. But I don't really know. There's, again, there's not really any cool frame places besides 
And we don't get like a professional frame made. I just buy like one of the ready-mades. Uh, Cause you know, I'm not, I'm not gonna be all high maintenance like that. I'm just gonna be like, oh, this one's good enough. Okay, so there's that. So that's her whips. My, that's my whip. <laughs> I hope to have an HD. Ooh. And guys, okay, so I've been a happy waiting. Dance, even. Yes, yes, yes. I've been waiting to start something that I've had for years. Mm -hmm. It is probably one of my only non Mirabilia's. It is not a Chatelaine. It is not a Mirabilia. It is not a Nora Cor. Okay, I say Corbett, but Kenny said Corbett. It would be interesting to know which one it is. Just like Leslie from uh, from Under the Sea Fabrics, it's Leslie. I say Leslie, so that's how I roll. Because you're weird. Nobody says Leslie. Well, they're all on the it's other Leslie. side of the U.S. It's Leslie. Like Glasgow. Oh, man. No. Okay, so anyways. Glasgow? How do you say it? Glasgow? Okay, so anyways, <laughs> I... Uh, I'm just kidding, Nora. And <laughs> I'm really good at that. Uh, so, yeah. So, anyways, it is. So, I'm not going to say what it is. So, you have to tune in. Oh. We're going to record it next week. I'm going to start it. You're going to start it before And I'm then? really, really excited because it's actually a kit. Comes in kit form. I'm going to do some hints. You guys can guess. Okay. I won't tell you if you're right or not, though. Uh, you'll just have to tune in. But it comes in kits. Yeah. The kits are very expensive. Mm -hmm. It comes with pre-dyed or printed fabric, but I am not using the pre-dyed or printed fabric because first of all, it's Ada and I don't do Ada. But second of all, I, uh, I have a pull stitches fabric for it that I bought specifically for this pattern. And, um, I am very, very <laughs> excited, by it. very excited by it. So it's something I want to start for a while. And the only reason why I've chosen to do this is because I'm in the mood. I said last video, I am one that wants to stitch something if it's the season. So like, uh, yeah, he has a bunch of patterns I can stitch. I don't want to start a Halloween one when it, oh, cute. All this does I don't is wanna, make me think we need to get some other designs beside Halloween. I tried to I have Halloween, you yeah. design me another mermaid because I, like I want to do a mermaid or something, but Good. you won't, you refuse. I do refuse. He refuses. I refuse. So uh, I would have, but you didn't. So it sucks to be you. <laughs> so anyways, uh, yeah. Uh, so yeah, that I, I'm going to start that. And then maybe he'll... I want you to stitch other things. You I want, like stitching I want other to things. stitch other things. So you, but I also want to stitch your things. But I am not quite ready for Halloween yet. I will be ready for Halloween towards the end of the summer. But I I don't care if I don't have a project done. Say I start a Halloween one. I don't care if I don't have it done and framed and ready to display by Halloween. I want to work on it in the Halloween season. So again, I was saying there was two different stitchers. Those who want to stitch it in the season and those who want to stitch it before the season to get it done for the season. Did I just say, was that, did that make any sense? <laughs> so anyways, uh, yeah. So if you could be so kind, I know how easy these are for you to do. How dare you? Literally, this is like so easy for you to stitch or to not stitch to Dude, it takes a little bit prepare. of no, it be doesn't. prepared. It takes a little bit of, uh, thought and effort. Okay. I well, mean, it's, 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 it's on easier than end. doing this. Yeah. So for sure, I would have loved to do that. I've been asking you for weeks now. Listen, I started listen doing me. one. If Kenny had asked, he would have done. Would have been done, done. I started one, and then I got what a douche. I got in the last video. I started drawing cats. I literally started the mermaid, and then started drawing cats. <laughs> and then she gave me a, a hard time in the last video. So I'm never drawing a mermaid again. Ah, uh, it's awesome. Okay, stash acquisition. Here we go. Anyways, I'm so close. She's so close, y'all. It's gonna look good. It's gonna look awesome. Okay, so stash acquisition. So, yeah. <laughs> shocker, uh, it's hand dyed by Rolanda again. Uh, some of her stuff. So, I have never had a bead case. I have. I have done. I've had the little uh, tacky bobs. Tacky bob is a tack. You don't know. 
I don't know why I'm going to ask you. A tacky, bob. a tacky bob. And I've kind of made my own tacky bobs well, where I will get a, a, a gift card tin. And then you just put double stick tape on it. And then you pour in your beads and you have your tacky bob. Uh, but this was so freaking cute. And I'm not the even a bee bob. person. But Aaron got me kind of in the bee mentality with his freebie, which is on our website if you want to go check it out. She couldn't help herself, y'all. Our Facebook page. I've got to do the shameless plug. Um <laughs> So anyways, it's it was just this one's from Hand Eye Threads by Rolanda. Or, well, it's from there. I'm sure she doesn't make these. I'm sure she buys these pre-made. But um, it's so cute. Who knows? Yeah, maybe she does. I don't know. But this did get our minds thinking about another business venture. But we're not going to say anything quite yet. Okay. But she also included a cute little whale. Babe, are we having a whale of a great time? What is that thing? It's a little, like, you can make... For threads, or...? No. You, like, can cross-stitch some fun little thing oh, and, and do something, something with it. it. I don't know fun. if you maybe make it... I guess you could make it maybe into a necklace, like, attach a little thing there and have it be a necklace, or you I personally... stitch it and then make it a necklace? That'd be fun. Yeah, and, but I personally would maybe make it new, stitch something on it, and then make it into a little needle minder. Mm -hmm. That's maybe. cool. I don't know. What What do you think I should do with it? I think that I should make it into a Have cute you seen something like writer. that before and what did you do with it? Oh, is a great question. Probably like a little necklace or something. That's probably they what attach the little, a little Yeah, that's probably what the little hole is for. Well, the little hole's no. his eyeball. Well, I know, but maybe that's doubles, I don't know. I know it's supposed to be the eyeball, but maybe that's where your chain goes through, even though it's pretty tiny. I don't know. Either way. Well, no, not your chain. You have a little connector. Oh, yeah. You're such a right. man. <laughs> okay, so I got that you're such a man. You're such a man. You're like a little, little, man. Like little man. Yeah, it's just so fun. And it has, like I said, it has this little magnets that attaches it. Now, I don't know if I'll use it for its intended purposes because, like I said, I like to use a tacky bob or really a cool, poor though. man's version of a tacky bob, a.k.a. the one I do, uh, by just double stick taping it. But um, this is super cute. Yeah, that's cool. This is really cute because I like to have it like on my fabric because if it's a metal container, I just stick a magnet underneath and it just sticks to my fabric. Almost like a needle miter. So I like the, the, the easy, you know, ha the it's easy access. Yeah, convenience. Convenience. Word. You got me. Okay. And then it occurred to me, I really seem to like blue fabric. Because this was all from Rolanda's uh, last update. Rolanda. Rolanda. And uh, they all look the exact same. And, but I don't care. Uh, what up, they don't really. But uh, So this is a 28 count Lugana. Would you look at that? Mm -hmm. A nice mermaid. Some pinks and purples and some greens in there. Of course, some blues. So there's that one. I like that one. I'm so mad she had an update today and I partially missed it. Probably the best it. one. IMO. Uh, I missed it. I missed her. Uh, I, I, I mean, I ended up seeing it, but uh, I, it, here's the thing. What? Some Etsy shops will let you click their sales and you can see what they've sold and what it looks like. I like that. Rolanda does not have that set up so that it drives me insane that I can't click on there and see what pieces of fabric I missed. Not that it makes a difference because I can't have them anyways, but I really want to see what I've missed. There's a reason some people but, do that. But. I know, but like for her, it, you know, I, a lot of you guys have said, well, she will work with you. And if you say, you know, you want something, she'll, she'll do her best to comment. She'll like do a, a fabric just for you. Well, I want to see what she sold so I can say, yo, Rolanda. Rolanda. Don't dye me up some of these. So, I don't know. Maybe I'll ask her and say, hey, can you maybe make that feature available so that I can see what I missed today? <laughs> okay. This is an Opal Lugana 28 counts. Look at that one. Those greens coming through there. Do you know what's so funny? Erin's like, that's so busy. I was like, dude, for a mermaid? Are you kidding me? This is perfect for a mermaid. Oh, Perfect for it, a mermaid, Aaron. It still looks amazing. Oh, yeah. Nope. It still looks amazing, but he's... he's That's not that bad. He's, it's not. It's not... When, when the colors says are in the same bad. family, it's not too bad. He's just I mean, worried about like stuff clashing. Blue, As the green. artist, he doesn't want stuff clashing. Okay, here's another one. Well, this I'm one is worried about awesome. it taking over the... Taking over the design? Yeah. Look at that You one. don't want that. That one's cool. This one has a lot okay. of pinks and oh, greens over cool. here that you're not seeing a whole lot of. Pinks and purples. And I told greens. you guys from the start, Cassandra is a fabric hoarder. You act like I am. I promise you, I am not out, oh, in, yes, out of the are. ordinary. 
I am not. I don't know if you're out of the ordinary, but Aaron, let me just tell you. Oh, show. Let me just tell you. What? Uh, people tell like me. Janet, my friend Janet Cottrell. She's in California. I love Janet. Janet has a whole like armoire cabinet that Janet is all is also devoted to her fabric only. You could have a armoire as well. <laughs> I said that just because she hates it. <laughs> Armoire. And then here's the last one that I got. This is the only other stash acquisition this I've gotten. This one's really good too. This one's nice. Um, look at that. They all kind of look the same. They're showing a lot more aggressive on the camera. I too. know. I've said that before. In her pictures also, they uh, show a little bit more aggressive than they are in real life. They're a little bit less. But I, I like. I think her fabric colors are awesome. Like that one is a perfect example because there's a lot going on, mm -hmm. but it's in the same color, so it's not too overpowering. Uh, aggressive. You think? Yeah. Maybe I like my fabric like how I like my men. Aggressive. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Oh, uh, look how cute it is. So look how cute, cute it is. Wait, I'm not done yet. Oh, well, I was gonna. Say, that's what I was gonna say. I wasn't gonna say that. I, I was gonna go with that just because it's. Okay. Together. So okay, well then I will. No, okay, no, so um, Rolanda. Rolanda. Uh, she was like, "Hey, I'm gonna send some freebies. Uh, one for you and one for or two for customers. Um, don't actually think we're gonna send these out for like five weeks. We will send them out. Case in point, Jillian still doesn't have hers from Jillian the last video. Get hers. Uh, we will send it though, but um, yeah. We will. Uh, well, anyways, video, you keep saying that we shouldn't even mention it because it's going to be gone by the time the video starts. But well, I, we know. Call I was going to say, I said earlier that we were going to do it today, but then I realized I'm not, we're not going to the post office today. We're going to go tomorrow. Okay. So anyways, uh, we've got two. Okay. Here's the thing. So she's like, one of the silks is for you and it's one of these. And I didn't realize they're not the same pack. This has a brown in it and this one has like more of a teal. So one of these, you're going to get one of, or we'll do a, a giveaway. Uh, I don't know which one of these packs I want to keep though. Cause she did say one is for me. I don't hoard threads, but I think it'd be really fun to have some silks. So why not? Uh, and that Time was so out. nice of her. That was so nice of her to do that. So thank you, was, Rolanda, if you're you, watching. Rolanda. And she's just on Etsy guys. Um, and she has her here. Look. Hand dyed by Rolanda. Rolanda. She's in Canada. I have to say this. Oh. I get her stuff quicker from Canada than I will get something other people's that I buy off Etsy that are in America, like in, in the United States, rather. Ooh. She yeah. is lightning fast with shipping, and I will get it hypothetically if I bought a piece of fabric today from her. Jillian, we're usually the same way, Jillian. <laughs> We're lightning fast. Yeah, we're normally shipping. lightning fast with shipping when I know what the crap to put it in. But anyways, uh, hypothetically <laughs> speaking, if I bought something uh, from Rolanda today, which I didn't. You didn't, huh? Uh-uh. Oh, that's good for you. I would Way probably get it in like strength. three or four days. Here's the thing. Hypothetically? Rolanda, hypothetically, Rolanda does Ada's. Oh. And she updates her, updates her shop every Thursday. Yeah. She does Ada's one Thursday, which I don't do. And then even we like Lugana, like 28 counts and 40 counts and 32 counts. Those are all my counts, y'all. She does those the next Thursday. So I, I'm not buying anything next Thursday. You're welcome. So you're not <laughs> buying anything this Thursday or next Thursday? Maybe. Whew. I love it. <laughs> How much did you buy? Can you at least tell us? Or is know. it too, too? <laughs> okay, give these things away. So, what do they have to do? do? So, wait, so one is regular fit thread. Look how happy those are. I know what I'm gonna ask. I normally would be a really attracted to these. I love, I actually, oh, balls. Wow. I really, um, I like all colors. So anyways, whoever's going to get the other pack of this, whether or not I choose to keep the one with teal or the one with the kind of we more brown. Yes. Oh. But So one of you is going to get one of these, a silk, and the other person's going to get one of the, the um, cottons. Things. 
one of the cottons. And this is just her floss of the month. And then this is a limited edition. These are nice. all silks. I like it. And these are her, uh, she has floss of the month. So if you are a, a thread hoarder, she's always updating her, her floss, I feel, because I always see her floss updating. But as you know, I'm a fabric hoarder, not a floss hoarder. So um, anyways, so what do they have to answer? I got it. The same question I, so I asked this in our group today because this bad Larry is out. Mm -hmm. Do you prefer printed charts or PDF charts when you buy your charts? Do you have preference? That's boring. That, that's the question. <laughs> that's the question. What if they did something nope. like, nope. no, 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 wait, nope. wait. That's for the first thread. <laughs> okay. That's for this thread. No, it's not. Or it's one of these. Of one of these. Okay. Do you so you've got to answer that. Print charts or PDF charts? So there's the first question. If you have a preference. To get entered into the second drawing, yeah. here's the question for this. Make it confusing for them. Ready? Yeah. Did you look that? My lip was itchy. Okay. Ready? Yeah. Tell them. What pattern would you want to stitch? For what? Like. It's just ideas, man, for you then to give us ideas. So like I have never seen, but would love to stitch something like an Egyptian goddess. <laughs> really? Mm -hmm. Have I, I don't know if I, what? I don't have know. Have I showed that? No. You just gave it away, man. I don't know what you're doing. No, I'm just saying like, if is there something that you've always wanted to see? Oh, like God. I know my friend Shannon, yeah. uh, Shannon Hibbard, call out to you. I miss you, my friend. Uh, Shannon has always wanted to see a voluptuous mermaid pattern. Cause she says that they're all, I'm on um, that man. They're all like, you know, little teeny tiny. They're, you know, for the most part, like Aaron's Curvy. mermaids are, you know, they're curvaceous, mm -hmm. but she wants to see more of a, uh, a, a very voluptuous mermaid. So, um, something like that. Maybe what? you want to see, well, I won't give that away cause that's Leslie, Leslie's oh. thing. Yeah. But, um, maybe there's, you know, do you have any ideas well, of something just, that you want to, that you would like? I know. And I mean, you know, is well, there something that you have wanted to stitch, but just cannot But just haven't find found it. a pattern that you love. Yeah. That's a good question. Yeah. Do you prefer printed charts or PDF yes. charts? <laughs> lame, jo uh, lame question, or do you prefer or uh, what would you Listen, like to stitch a pattern out? And it can mine. even be something like, you know what, hookers? I have seen, we are the hookers. Do you, <laughs> that made no sense. Do you like say, hey, I've seen some geishas around here. And nobody will stitch or nobody will design a purple geisha or a blue geisha or a bright orange geisha. I've seen a red geisha. I actually don't know because I've never stitched a geisha before. Geishas are not my thing. Although I really liked that one geisha book. Memoirs of a Geisha. That, that was a good book. So, as you guys know. Uh, oh, I'm going to show them the. Oh, okay. So, we're not done yet. But uh, I decided. So, as you guys know, I started off making needle minders. I have. So many, including ones that Aaron did design himself. And I've got so many. And here's the thing. I don't want to put them all on our Etsy store. Um, so I decided, you know what? I'm going to highlight one to three of them. Every time we do a floss tube video and say, okay, these are going to be up in the Etsy store. Here's how. I'm going to reorder these, man. Yeah. Okay. So anyways, um, I don't even know. I don't know if we can. If we can. Yeah. Something so anyways, um, so, sh so I, these are both designed by Aaron Word. and we had these made and I actually already have a bunch made up, maybe like, uh, maybe like five or six or something, um, already made up. So they're going to be available in our Etsy store. And, um, just to show you. So the first one is obviously Captain Jack. My we'll guy. call him a pirate because we can't say that he's Captain Jack oh, yeah. because he's copyrighted by Disney and copyrighted. Disney takes their break, stuff Disney. very seriously. So uh, clearly he's got his bottle of booze and he has little rhinestones, his little rhinestone uh, thing up here. Isn't that adorable? And his eyes are rhinestones. Pirate. But anyways, he actually looks a lot like my brother here. It does not look like Bob. Yeah. Totally looks like Bob. Okay. So anyway, <laughs> that totally looks like my brother. Um, anyway, so this... Hair. 
this Super yeah cool. his hair dreadlock hair he's holding his sword but his little bottle of booze aruski anyway so we have them and these are more expensive because we actually only have them for 15 bucks which i don't think is super expensive because who are the who are the people accoutrement what Ooh, i don't know right i'm not french accoutrement <laughs> accoutrement who's that uh, they do nail miners and they're sort of like 20 plus dollars. And, uh, a lot of theirs I have for sale also, but, um, I, but yeah, they, these are ours exclusive to us only, designed, uh, designed by Aaron, dr drawn by Aaron, designed by Aaron, blood, sweat and tears. But, um, yeah, so he's up, he's going to be up in the Etsy store. I have a limited amount of him. I have some of him already made. And perhaps what I'll do is I'll put up, I'll maybe put up the already made ones and say these are ready to ship, but then have um, have the ones that, because I have to make them if they're not already made. Like, I mean, just gluing the magnet on because they're already made like this, but the ones, yeah. So anyways, I'll have a certain amount of him up. I probably have five, six, seven of him already made up. That's going to be the only like actual like known character that I'm going to do. Yeah. Because we liked him and here, we'll yeah. put him on, him on fabric so you I don't remember see. why we did that, but all, all going forward, everyone is going to be our own design. Because we liked Jack, yeah. Here's, here we go. So there he is with a needle on him, just to, for size. Well, we did the for Sanderson size sisters too. But. Yeah, we did do the Sanderson sisters. Uh, but that's, we love that movie. Oh, but yeah, yeah, Hocus Pocus is our jam. Okay, the other one that we have up that is an Aaron original. This is more what I'm talking about. Um, so we had a hot pink hair one. She is currently completely sold out. We do have this purple hair one, that pretty kind of plum look. But uh, what you're not seeing is her whole tail is um, done with like a pearlescent kind of paint. So it's very swirly and you can't see that, Why but it's that very swirly. you put that mermaid pattern you're stitching over there, Cassandra? I should. Um, anyways, and then she's also holding a pearl. What about a, doing so a bundle? So she has a pearl in her hand. Gotta do a mermaid bundle, man. Mm -hmm. We're missing the boat. So Why? anyways, uh, there she is with like a little, but look how cute she is. Erin actually had her... I had her eyes open originally. No lips. And she no had lips. super, no lips. And I was I like, what like are the, you doing? Smile. Yeah, so this is another but one of those. But y'all know how Cassandra does. This is another one of those. I'm like, she needs big old lips, sweetheart. And he made them for me. So <sighs> she's going to be available too. I don't know if we will ever be able to reorder her, but uh, we do have her purple. This is super cute. We're not working um, with the printer that we used before. Yeah, so, she, I mean, I still have her email so I can see, but she might have, because she changed on. locations twice. But anyway, so there she is. So she's also going to be, I have a certain number of her made. Um, this came out so good, man. Yeah, so I have a certain number of her made, but this is, again, both of these are designed by Aaron, made by Aaron. If you see copies of these two, they are an illegano copy, my friends. Illegal copy. Which you, um, even though this is a copyrighted character. <laughs> but Aaron, no, it's fan art, man. This is just a pirate. So I don't know who he was talking about. Yeah. He's just a pirate. What this was, are gone, he those drew are gone. my brother as a pirate. <laughs> He really does look it's like It's my that. brother as a pirate. Uh, is but then this costume. is Aaron for realsies. Yeah. Aaron. So Aaron uh, drew these. We had them made up. They are needle miners. So again, we have only a certain, um, a few amount, maybe five to 10 of each ma already made that I'll be able to ship out immediately in our Etsy store, which is Autumn Lane Stitchery. Um, Cassie's needle minders is no more. We, I mean, I still have the group, um, but yeah, they're both 15 bucks each. Maybe the mermaid's 13 Maybe she's 15. Uh, there's somewhere around there. Uh, 13 to 15. They'll be linked <laughs> down below. Yeah, right. so they'll be linked down below. But uh, remember, some will be ready to go. If they're oh, not ready to go, I always say that it, it takes up to seven days. Uh, it won't. I'll, I'll have them done and, you know, ready to ship in three to four days. So uh, not business days, three to four days in general, because every day is a business day. So those two adorable ones are the ones that we're going to feature today yeah. um, that I'm going to re put them in our Etsy store. So I think that's a good idea. I have so many, you guys. and I Not that we made, just ones that you you have, yeah, right? That, yeah. We've made, I don't know, maybe five to ten somewhere. We have there. the turkey... The Christmas, the Christmas thing, month. the Sanderson sisters. Either way. Turkey. We'll be highlighting those bad no, We'll legs. be highlighting those. But eventually, and I know we said this before, eventually we want to get to the point where 
when we release a pattern, we have a matching needle minder. And maybe if she has beads, a matching bead container. Would be the dream. Teamwork makes Team, the dream I'm, work. I'm just letting you guys know my hopes and dreams for the future. We'll see. Without Aaron in it. Just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just kidding. Good I luck. Right? I can't do any of this Good without Aaron. Doing this Aaron without me. bit the big one or fell to, into an untimely death. Like the brakes failed or... <laughs> or... I happened to eat some poison in my food. Yeah. He suddenly got salmonella and died from a bad chicken Lord, or whatever. take me now. <laughs> yeah, he would be... Uh, it, it's not... I didn't do it. Uh, but yeah, Don't this, come would, this would be me. no more, which would really suck. So yeah. unfortunately, I've got to keep him around. Okay, so... <laughs> I, I it is it now again... May, so I had this pattern, well, this design drawn. Technically, this is the last day of the month. Can you not have this video ago. up today? I don't know, today or tomorrow. It's the 30th it's today. Okay. FYI. Of April. And so, you know, we do our monthly series. As we film this video. Yeah. You know, it, we, I try to have it out ahead of time. I'm constantly behind, man. Yeah. No matter what I do. And this month, I was, I was way ahead. Meticulous. I was so far ahead this time. too meticulous. But... But I harassed you and video, asked you to get the geisha done. She's like, oh, I bet you can't have it done. Guess what? Bam. It only took us three weeks to do the next video. Done. Yeah, because of you. Thanks. Hey, Cassandra, let's have a goal for you. Okay. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I'm Not just kidding. to kill Aaron. No, yeah. The next please video. don't poison me. This UPS man's back. <laughs> He's driving around the block. So... I got busy. Like, there's, we're doing other things. So, mm -hmm. I'm going to show you kind of the process behind this pattern. I'm going to show you what this next May pattern is going to be. It should have been out by now. But it's it's not. so, okay, guys, here's the thing. And let me say this real quick. Love there it. are okay. so many people who say, well, that. May, you know, January here is super warm and you have snow in your patterns. Um, Aaron, aren't you going to start including a new. Got it on here. Yeah, oh, okay. So we'll address that. So if you are in the opposite part of the world than Excuse. us and you have our feet, our feelings, our season swapped, we've now got you handled. Excuse Aaron, tell me about it. our uncultured Sorry. selves. We don't think of stuff like that because we're douche, douchebags. So, yeah. So what we're going to do is include all, I'm going to include an extra page with all the, the months, the, the words charted out. So if, you know, it's warm where you are in January... Or, you know, you can get the June pattern and put January in it, vice versa. Yeah. Okay, so... so we got gonna, you guys handled. We got it covered. We got you guys. I'll, I gotta go back and... I don't know. I don't I'll know figure if I, it out. We'll figure it out. Anyway, so I'll, I kind of want to show you... they can just use the same writing. I mean, like, yeah, you can just way. have a generic letters that they can just sub it in there. Yeah. Either way. So, what I always do, like I keep saying, is in the, in the group, we always ask... I always Join do a bunch group. of sketches... Chamber and say, fun. which one would you prefer? Like, which one do you like, essentially? So, in when I first originally did, I did what I do. I did eight designs, okay? So, I did this page, and then I did mm. this page, okay? So, I gave them, I gave them a choice of those eight designs. I'm just tired. <laughs> <laughs> I gave them those eight designs and let them, like, just ask their opinion which one would they like to see. It gives me a good idea what everybody... Would like. I still kind of choose which one. Normally, what I choose is what everybody else kind of goes along with. Plus, I have to have her advice because I'll never hear the end of it if I don't, y'all. <laughs> so happy wife, happy life, Aaron. Yeah. Holy God! Oh, I never, well, I never finished my thought. I'm not. I don't love. Oh, how do I say this without seeming like I hate your stuff? I am not gonna do a little small chart. Just because I don't, it's just not my thing. We yeah, have our I'm things okay and we that. have our things that we like. I like this geisha. I'm not someone who's going to probably stitch a geisha. Although I really love this one. I probably, we were talking about that. How I was like, should I just stitch it? Give that back to Kenny. Cause I actually really love this chart. But, um, I, I love this one so much. So she is, uh, loves, does love small patterns. I love this one. I just one. haven't made something that she likes yet, I essentially. Lo I love this one. I love this one. I love this one. Show it. Show it, show it, show it, show it. Show it. All right. So it is so I, So good. I started with the sketches, and then the next round, I'll go and I'll kind of refine it. 
which, um, uh oh, I'm so tired. So I start with, th I started with this one here. So these two are the top. I'll just show the whole thing. So the top two, there are, yes. uh, are the like. So it, it was going a little bit too realistic. Look at, by the way, look at the little bee, his little butt hanging out of the flower there. He's adorable. Okay, so you can see I kind of have the bird. I did two different birds. That bottom one, he's kind of leaning over, smelling the flower, and then the top one. He's flying down onto the to the little pole there, but so the first the top two were the first two sketches that I did. It was getting a little bit too realistic because it's a smaller pattern, so I won't I won't be able to kind of achieve what I'm going for there without doing like a whole lot of backstitch and making it super difficult. And I'm trying to make these easy to do. Yeah. So I thought I really like the folk art kind of stuff. So I was like, well, what if I take it in kind of that direction? I can make it a little bit more simple, but there's lots of pretty colors and it's super interesting to do. So uh, we took it in. So here's kind of a close up of the. the uh, I love that one is so cute with the. That's so see, cute. the flowers are getting a little bit too much detail in there. It, it just would be hard to accomplish. It's a smaller pattern, so it'd be really hard to accomplish. But so here is the sketch for what May is going to be. I mean, I'm, oh, already, I'm already working the colors. on it. But yep, it is. I know you're just so about those little legs are so cute that these they're little like hanging out there. Out. <laughs> it's so he's cute. reaching in there to get some honey. So this is kind of yeah. going in that folk Hold art, on. kind of very colorful. Look at the birdhouse, man! So much fun. I Look at the ladybug. Ah, oh, there's a little ladybug oh, in there. I didn't notice that up here. Yes, yeah. he's climbing up the little I, the little uh, oh branch gosh. there. The Aaron, stem. I love that one. So this is going to be May, which looks, you know, really good. But again, I love that one. Here is so we have him either sitting on the branch or I haven't. I mean, I still haven't decided yet. He's like flying on. I kind of like the fact that the bird like landing, you know, gives a little that bit of motion. Cute. Let me see, because I have he hasn't shown me this because he yeah. he communicates about as well as a turd. <laughs> Just to be, you know. I only talk to her when I have gross. to, yeah. yeah. So either we can have him flying on there, or I, I really like him hanging over the edge of it, kind of so like smelling Aaron. the flower. He's so cute. But that's that's going to be... I don't know which one I like better. More. I know. That's why I haven't decided. He's so cute know. there, though. I like his little... I know. I don't know. So isn't that cool? Some cool design of the bird, little folk art that. style. It's just very colorful, very fun. And I just... Birdhouses are cool, man. Birdhouses bird are cool. birdhouse up there for you. We can stick the birdhouse behind us when so that's, we decide that's to replace it. going to be May. Let us know what you guys think, if you care. But, yeah. I love it's that. It's fun. I love so that. So that'll be May, and then we'll instantly start on June. Yeah. Get them summer months coming up. Or winter months, depending on where you live. Or winter months. Oh, so, yeah. Anyway. So, like, this is probably what I'm going to do with... Uh, oh, yeah. The, the text. So, I'll... Uh, I'll give you like every month. I'll I'll chart those out and then include those in the pattern. That way, if it's not your month or if it's warm when it's cold here, mm -hmm. we're 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 everybody is included. Somebody brought that to my attention. and I was like, that is a great idea. Okay, mm -hmm. so the giveaway. Make sure you answer the questions. If you've hung around till now, till now, we appreciate you. Thank you very much. You guys are the best. Answer we the appreciate questions. you. Geisha's Two out. questions because Answer you know the what? Questions for I'm not letting her override me. Do you like PDFs or printed charts? I'm saying they have to answer or, one question for the other one, or the other one. You've got to answer or, a second question. What was it again? What would you like what to see? Would you like if you to have see? if you if there's something that you haven't seen around that and you're that like, you oh, like, I wish there really was. Go. I want a stitch of voluptuous mermaid. I'll do it for you. Or I, don't even care. I want to see a uh, mermaid. You know what else? I don't want to take up too much time, but at. Uh, at Nashville, we did for all the shops that were uh, purchasing from us. We were we were doing oh, a yeah. giveaway. Yeah. For I'll kind of work with their shop and do a. a Aaron a, was a, doing a giveaway. Yeah, I'll do a I'll do a, a free pattern for their shop. Or free whatever. I'll do a pattern for their shop that only they had. Yeah. Kind of, you know, just something exclusive for them. I thought that'd be really fun. And we got the winner uh, for that, which was Accents in Stitches, a shop Accents. in New Orleans. Oh. 
Oh, and knowledge. She was super grateful that she won. So I'm, I'm excited about that. Yeah, he was. So I'll show you. The, I'll, I'll show you the guys. He was that very happy. While it's in process and stuff. He is very. He's a very grateful human being. He always makes sure you know he says thank you. He's always has to help people. You know, Lord. Aaron's very much appreciative of anybody else who is appreciative and shows gratitude for things. And so, um, she, she, Aaron, not a she. <laughs> Aaron was uh, after he announced it and he's like I'm actually really glad she won yeah we got we got a good a good uh shop that was very appreciative because she she was saying she'd had a rough time and um yeah. that sh she couldn't believe she won and how grateful she was for that so that's actually really so I'll cool. take you guys along for the process on that one Ooh. also I figured out we don't have a webcam break that man I am gonna break that yeah we don't have a webcam I've been wanting to do like design with me's uh type videos where I just sit down and design patterns and we can all hang out. I'm trying to get Cassandra in there because then she can sit there and He does. He, we've been talking about this. Do you, like, don't you think that would be interesting? Interesting of just watching Aaron kind of sketch stuff out that can possibly turn into a pattern because he'll just sit there and sketch and then you're like, oh my gosh, that like a scene, like a mermaid scene. You'll be like, oh my gosh, that is so cool. And then I'll be like, mm, and then he'll just like do a whole nother sketch of like the same thing, but it's like even better. And you're like, dude, like the first one was great. This one's incredible. Uh, please like, but then you're gonna have a bunch of people who are like, hey, can you chart that? Great. Can you chart that? And then, yeah. <laughs> It'd just but be wouldn't cool. that be Listen, exciting? It'd it's, be interesting. We'll just be us sitting down chatting and we can have people. Yeah, but nobody wants to hear me chat. Of course they do. No. I mean. I don't, but they might. <laughs> so we'll be doing that soon too. I have no idea. We'll probably announce it on our. He also media. wants to do one of me, just us chatting and me stitching, like a close up of. Yeah, dude. Because people are doing that, right? Dude, here's the. It'll like like you'll be able Instagram? to see her and then you see what she's stitching. And I uh, did. That'd be and just awesome. Watch. People love it. Okay. Which, I mean, I see people doing it. Okay. I think it'd be I super do. interesting. I don't know what I'm going to talk just, about, though. It would just be like doing this, like a floss tube. We've been chatting for over but an hour. But you know, I can't, I'm like a guy. I can't do more than like one thing at once. Dude, facts. <laughs> uh, so, I mean, well, there's lots of things we want to do. We definitely want to be doing weekly videos. We do. The and last two we apologize every other week. But. Yeah. It's all good. I think it's going to rain. Do you think it will have a fun thunderstorm? I we hope love so. thunderstorms. We I open so. up our back French French doors. So, we get it. <laughs> so we hope you're well. Yeah, we do. We appreciate you hanging out with us. And we do. This has been Floss Tube number six, man. We made it to number six. We Congratulations. Did. We made it to all, we've made it to 11 years of marriage, sir. <laughs> Congrats. I should be getting the congratulations here. I should be getting a thank you or something. Dude. No. <laughs> All right. Thank you, you by the way. Yeah, you're welcome. Oh, wait. You're welcome, <laughs> by the way. You are totally welcome. You're welcome, Aaron. Right. Thank you very much. Bye, guys. The Geisha is out. Go oh. Go get yourself some Puberty, of that. Puberty, apparently. Go She's grab amazing. yourself Etsy store. We, we will actually send it out very quick. As long as you don't win floss, we're very prompt. <laughs> it's coming, Jillian. With Jillian, don't our... Hate us. Dude, it's maybe coming. Jillian will buy the Geisha. We'll stick it in her package. You never know. Come on, Jillian. That would save us. <laughs> You know, Come on, Julian. trying to figure this crap out. It right. really shouldn't be that hard to figure out. Just kidding, Until Julian. next time. Yes. Till we, we bid meet you again. a farewell. Are you going to sing? <laughs>